Hey there, welcome to another video of how to infinity channel. Today I'll show you how you can make bootable pen drives using common prompts of you via your computer. You all know that bootable pen drives are so much important today. Those who have latest versions of laptops, we all know that there are no CD-ROMs on our laptops in the latest versions. So we have to install Windows via any USB stick. But uh, most of us doesn't know how to make a bootable pen drive or because without bootable pen drive we can't install windows via USB stick. The USB stick should be bootable. So today I'll show you uh, one option by which we can make bootable pen drives. There are so many other options like softwares etc. But I'll show you how we can make a bootable pen drive in, a, in seconds using CMD or common prompt. So let's start. For making the bootable pen drive we will be needing an USB pen and USB drive or a pen drive which should be at least 8 GB or 16 GB. I have a pen drive which will be which is 32 GB and you will also need a Windows soft ISO file that means the windows that you want to install in your laptop or computer the file should be ISO file or folders file so you should have the file of Windows and a pen drive. Now go to your Laptops common prompt. I'll open one. Then type this part. I will also provide the comments in the comment section. So watch the video till the end. How to use that? First, I will type this part. Then you have to type yes. Now I'll type list this, which will show all the disks in my laptop. I have inserted the pen drive into my laptop so there are two drives this one is my hard drive and this this zero is my hard drive and this one is the pen drive that I have inserted so you, you will type uh, if you have SSD or hard drive then the pen drive should be disk 2 or disk 3 and you will show which one is a pen drive by the size in the screen that means my pen drive is 28 GB so this is the disk one and this is the pen drive now you have to select the disk Clean the disks. Now create partition primary. We will create a partition which will make it good. Now select partition 1. format NTFS quick remember if your system sub um, supports UEFI then you should format it via FAT FAT32 FAT quick that means you will type here format FS FAT quick or uh, normally you will type NTFS quick so you will, will format it in NT NTFS format then I will enter it wait for the format to be completed the format is completed then we will type active that means we will be activating our bootable pen drive the pen drive is now active so now our task uh, we, if we check the pen drive right now then we can see that it has 8.8 GB now we will copy the ISO file on the pen drive or the all the folders of the ISO file. We'll wait till it get copied. I will pause the video till then. Okay we are back again. It is almost finished. You must copy all the files if you miss any files then means the windows won't boot on your laptop so make sure to copy all the files of the windows
okay the file has been copied now we'll put out the pen drive and i will insert it again to see that if it's booted that to find that if it has been bootable or not so we'll reinsert the pen drive we'll see you can see this the pen drive is now bootable so you can insert the pen drive in your laptop and you can install windows via this bootable pen drive so that was all for today if you like the video please make sure to subscribe the channel and leave a comment i will make such types of video daily so okay then that's all for today